Hey everyone, welcome back to another Permaslug episode. My name is Jonathan, and today what I wanted to do is show you the Oxy Class Act plugin. And I'm not being paid or compensated for this. In fact, I bought this plugin with my own money out of need because I think it's just such a fantastic tool for workflow in Oxygen. So the website here is oxyplugins.com. This is by Sridhar and Gagun, who you probably know from the Facebook group in... Um, the, in you know any number of groups, they're a part of all of them. And basically what this plugin does is moves styling from an element's ID or a class, and it can go either way. So you can move styling from a class to an ID or from an ID to a class. So a practical use case of this would be if you set up styling like on this button or let's say these tabs, and then you realize, oh man, I forgot to set a class and I really wanna use this button somewhere else instead of clearing it out manually and having to add the class and restyle it, this plugin lets you just copy and move back and forth. So what I'm gonna do is demonstrate how you can use it and then um, just encourage you to go ahead and get it for your Oxygen sites. So in the back end, it's extremely simple to set up. All you have to do is just install the plugin, put in your license, and then when you get to the Oxygen Visual Editor, you'll notice there's a couple new buttons here. So we have Clear Styles, which is pretty self-explanatory. That just clears everything from the ID or the class, all the styles that you might have configured right here. Copy to Class moves every bit of styling that you've set up in these tabs to a class, and it will also ask you what you want the class to be called. And then move is effectively the same thing, but it takes it out of the ID and moves it to the class directly. So I have an example set up here of this button, and you'll notice this button does not have a class assigned to it. So if I wanted to reuse this, I could just duplicate the button, but then the changes that I make from one button to the other are not gonna be replicated around my site. Currently in Oxygen, what you would have to do is basically delete all of this styling add a class and then redo it. But with this plugin, all I need to do is basically click move to class and then I'm just gonna call this standard button one, something like that. Now it assigns a class to this button called standard button one. And then you can see all of the styling changes that I had in here, including the things under my hover effects are all still there. So extremely easy and time saving. And this is something that I run into a lot when I forget to assign a class. Even someone like me who I would consider experienced in Oxygen, I still just kind of that human side of things forget to assign classes. Now, of course, I did move and not copy. So if I go back to the ID here, you'll notice that all this changes back to the default Oxygen settings, which is really nice because that allows you to still override the styling of your class just by using this ID. Now, again, to my point earlier, this matters because if you did not have a class, the changes wouldn't replicate for the button. But now that we have a class, if we duplicated this out, if I change, let's say, the background color of this button, then we can see that both of them change thanks to the fact that there's a class assigned to the button now. So it's just a really nice usability tool. Now, one thing that you can do too with this is you can clear styles. So let's say you've styled these tabs, you have this background change, that box shadow on hover, and you can see there's um, kind of the font weight and all that sort of stuff configured on this class. Let's say you wanna clear that style. Right now in Oxygen, you'd have to go manually delete everything, but now what you can do is just go ahead and click clear and then click okay, and it's gonna ask you again, and now it's back to the defaults. So that could be a really nice time-saving tool as well. So all in all, this is a really cool tool. It's not very expensive, and I know that these guys are gonna have some more plugins on the site. After all, it's called Oxy Plugins. There's gonna be a lot more that they put out, and it's gonna be coded really well, and it's going to be supported for a long time. Hopefully this video has been helpful for you. Check this plugin out and give me your thoughts on it in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in a future video.